Hello student. Today we will learn from the world around us. Primary Social Studies Standard 3. Lesson number 3. The Earth and its Neighbors. As where we live, we have neighbors. Same way, Earth belongs to the family, which is known as solar system. With Earth, there are other seven planets who are revolving around the Sun. All these planets are our Earth's neighbors. Now let's study the solar system in this chapter. Our Earth belongs to the solar system. Besides Earth, there are seven other planets in the solar system who are revolving around the sun. All these planets are Earth's neighbors. Now let's see the solar system. Solar means off or from the sun. The solar system includes the sun, the eight planets and all the other smaller objects that move around it. Like our family, we have family members like mother, father, grandparents, uncle, aunt, cousins, etc. Same way, Earth family also has some members. There is sun, eight planets including the Earth and other small objects. They are moving around the sun. That family of the earth is known as solar system. The sun is the center of the solar system. Or you can say that sun is the leader of the solar system. All the planets including the earth move around the sun in their fixed orbits. The earth and the seven planets are continuously revolving around the sun on a fixed path which is known as orbit. All these planets do not have a light of their own. They don't have their light. They get, they get light from the sun. The eight planets in the solar system are let's start from the sun the first one is mercury venus earth mars jupiter saturn uranus and neptune so there are total eight planets which are continuously revolving around the sun earlier pluto was counted as the ninth planet of the solar system. However, it was later removed from the group of planets. It is now called a dwarf planet because it is too small to be a planet. There are some rules to whom we call, can call planet. So, Pluto is no longer is a planet now. Therefore, we have only 8 planets. We live on the planet Earth. Mercury is the closest planet to the Sun. Venus is the hottest planet in the solar system. See, each member or each planet in the solar system has its special quality. Mercury, which is the first planet or very close to the sun. Venus is the hottest planet in our solar system. Earth is the only planet where we can see the life. Because land, water and air is present only on the earth. Mars 
is also known as the red planet it has a red color jupiter is the largest planet in the solar system saturn is surrounded by brightest rings saturn has very beautiful rings around it uranus is the third largest of the eight planets neptune is the eighth planet from the sun on the same page you can see the picture of the sun and the eight planets revolving around the sun see in this you can see the jupiter with large in size among all of them see this saturn it has beautiful rings around it neptune is the last planet which is very far away from the sun and mercury is the first planet near the sun see the earth earth is on the third position from the sun now besides the sun and the planets the solar system consists of natural satellites or moons asteroids and comets let's see the moon all of you must have seen a white color ball in the sky of night that ball is known as moon the moon is the earth's nearest neighbor when we look up at the night sky we see the moon shining brightly besides the stars it is called the natural satellite of the earth it moves around our planet like the earth many other planets have small objects called natural satellites or moons revolving around them some planets have 27 moons and some of them are having 65 moons next part is that asteroids and comets there are chunks of rocks and metal found in the solar system these are called asteroids we can see some big rocks and metals which are revolving around the sun we call them asteroids scientists think that they are loose material that never form into planets the main asteroid belt is located between mars and jupiter see here in this picture there is a mars over here and this is the jupiter and can you see this belt it is asteroid belt which is revolving around the sun a comet is a mass of ice dust and rocky particles with a long tail sometime we see something is falling down from the sky we call it tutta tara also so that is a comet the name comet comes from the greek word comets meaning hair of the head it came from the greek philosopher aristotle who observed comets as stars with hair so that is about the earth and its neighbors learn the lesson and read again and again thank you